Alright, if you've clicked on this video and you're after coins in FIFA 20, you're in the right place. This is the best way to make coins right now as of... Just check my calendar. February 2020. So this is the best way to make coins right now. So make sure to watch the end of this video. Let's get into it. To get the cheapest FIFA coins on the internet, make sure to go and check out Mule Factory. I've left a link in the description and a discount code as well. You can get 100,000 FIFA coins for just eight pounds. Eight quid. Eight, eight quid. For 100,000 FIFA coins, go and check them out. They're 100% reliable. I've used them so, so much. Make sure to use the code LE5CHEAP at checkout. And let's get into the video. Oh, what is going on, guys? LE96, and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. In this video, I've got a training method for you guys. It's been a while since I've done one, but hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. If you're after some coins, this is the place to be because this is the best way to make coins right now in FIFA 20. With this method, I managed to get this Orsic card for 11,500 coins and sell them on and make a very, very decent profit, as you can see right here. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how I do this. This is a method which can make you a couple thousand coins every other minute, so it's a pretty Pretty decent method in my opinion. Now just whilst I set up this method, I know that you're probably going to be wanting some coins right now and I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm actually running a giveaway right now for 4,600 FIFA points and I'm giving it to the most active subscriber on this channel over the next month. This is a giveaway that I do pretty much quite a bit to be honest. All you guys need to do is like this video and loads of other videos any videos that you see just drop a like on them comment on this video and any other videos and just subscribe if you are new to being with a chance of winning that prize now for the filter what we're going to be doing is setting it up like this i want you to set the quality to special position leave blank chem blank club you can't do anything with it league blank nation blank play name blank Pricing though needs to be min price 10,000 coins, max price 15,000 coins, min by now 15 to 50. Now what we're going to do, it's going to be a very, very quick method. I'm going to try and slow it down as much as I can do so I can explain it as best I can do. Now what we're going to be doing is searching up and we're going to be finding players who have a bid on them who look like that they could be going for a pretty decent amount of coins. So we're going to search upon the market and what I'm going to do just to show you guys for this method, I'm going to just go forward just a couple of pages just so we've got a bit of time to sort work out how the method works so I've gone a bit further along and as you can see there's a couple of different cards chilling on the market right now and there's a couple of other cards who have got bids on them now we found this glick right here first things first what you need to do once you've found your player with a bid on them they have to have a current bid on them add them to your transfer target so you don't lose it so we found a glick right here at 13 and a half thousand coins now once you've found this card you then need to come back over to the market and check how much he's going for now you can use external sites like footbin if you want to however i would always recommend to use the market because it's always going to be the most up to date footbin can be slightly out of date and that's not what we want now as you can see right here i've actually just managed to find one for 13,000 coins who has actually gone straight away but if we put this price up you will be able to see that his minimum price on the market right now is 13,000 coins now if we found one at 13 and a half thousand we could pick one up at 13,750 and sell on at 14,750 for a decent profit so what I'm going to do is jump over to my transfer targets and I'm going to check to see how much he's going for now as you can see someone's already dropped a bid on him at 13,750 coins which if I was to drop a bid now at 14,000, there'd be no profit for me. So this one isn't really going to work. So I found a card right here who looks like that he would be going for something. I've checked on Footbin as well. I've checked on the market and he's consistently going for around 16,000 coins or maybe even more. I've dropped a bid at 11,000 coins right here. And this is where the method starts to take shape. You're going to be getting into quite a few bidding wars with this. Now, in terms of tips for bidding wars, I don't really have anything. You literally just have to be as patient as possible. And as you can see right here, I've actually managed to win a card at 11 and a half thousand coins on a Tammy Abraham now what I'm going to do really really quickly is jump over to the market and show you guys how much Abraham is going for I got pretty lucky with that one the guy just didn't outbid me back for whatever reason so what we're going to do is going to set this to 10 to 50 and we're going to search upon the market to see how much he's going for as you can see right here the very lowest is his 81 rated version which I'm actually quite surprised at so we need to find an 84 rated version and there's one there at 16 and a half thousand coins so this is going to be 
probably a pretty decent profit amount to be honest regardless of what I sell it on for so let's jump back over to the transfer targets as you can see right here and we've got ours at eleven and a half thousand coins which is very very nice indeed so what I'm actually going to do to get a quick sell on for this video is sell it at fifteen and a half thousand coins so that is a very very good result in my opinion we've managed to get ourselves an inform card for more or less minimum price we're selling them on for around four thousand coins profit as well which is very very nice indeed now with these cards you may be waiting probably upwards of 10 minutes for these to sell on but they'll always sell on just be a bit patient with it just been and made myself some cereal some uh, golden grahams if you're wondering let's see if our abraham sold on okay he's not sold on yet to be fair though i'd probably say that's one of the best deals that I've gotten today using this so make sure to go and try this method out super easy to use you just have to be quite patient hopefully there was enough steps in this video if you need help with anything just let me know down in the comment section but guys that is where I'm going to be wrapping up this video we are going to be back tomorrow with another video make sure to drop loads and loads of likes on this video like target is going to be I don't know just loads so hopefully we smash that like target but this has been l 96 for more trading and FIFA tips and all the rest of it. Make sure to subscribe to this channel. Turn notifications on as well so you never miss an upload. But this is 36 and I am off. Goodbye.